Hey guys, Eno here. Hope you're having a great day. And I've missed you guys. It's been a little while since we made our last video. Uh, so I know I had talked to you guys about making sort of a more serious video. So we have an unboxing today. Um, I'll save that one for another time. I did record it and then I just, mm, I wasn't happy with it. So um, I'm gonna re-record it because I, you know, I want to relay a certain amount of information to you guys and uh, yeah, I just wasn't happy with how that one came out. So I'm going to re-record that, but for today, we're doing an unboxing. So uh, I'm super excited about that. Before I get started with the unboxing, I do want to make sure that I don't forget to mention uh, that I'm still offering the Land Yachts Drop Hammer for my subscription giveaway. So once we hit a thousand subscribers, I will be selecting a subscriber randomly to give that board to. We're almost there guys. We're pretty close to 700. So we're getting there pretty fast. So I'm super excited. I honestly cannot wait to get you guys this board. All right guys, so here we go. Uh, so no surprise. I think some of you guys guessed it online. I did get a Land Yachts, but uh, this is a new board for this year. So I'm super excited about it. Let's get this opened. Everyone's favorite, stickers, because we all love stickers, right? We all love the stickers. Okay. All right, guys, are we ready? All right. So this is, uh, this is the new Land Yachts Tugboat. I think I've talked about this with you guys. I, I freaking love this, you guys. I love my other tugboat, the Flippy, and this comes with the new doozies, you guys. I'm super stoked to try these out. Look at those wheels. Let's see the front here. Wow. So smooth. Look at that, you guys. Oh my God, that is so nice. You gotta love the graphic. So uh, this, of course, is the uh, Land Yachts Tugboat for 2022 this is the jet ski fun edition uh so one of my favorite new features of this board and the reason that i ordered this board or that i started looking at this board in the first place was the narrower trucks so this board comes with 130 millimeter trucks as opposed to the previous model which came with 155s so by going with narrower trucks it does allow for more wheel clearance and it also makes the board more maneuverable now, I was originally looking at getting this with the Fatty Hogs, which I was super stoked on, until they dropped the Doozies. And uh, so they do offer it in two setups. One is with the Doozies, and the other is with the Fatty Hogs. Nothing against Fatty Hogs, but I am so stoked to try these out. Um, these are the 63 millimeter Doozies. Another thing that's different besides the trucks and the wheels is the width. Uh, so this board comes in at a length of 30 inches, a width of nine inches with a wheelbase of 15 inches. Now, what's different is the previous board came in with a width of 9.24 inches. So this one is a little bit more narrow, which I don't think is gonna be a bad thing. Nine inches is still plenty wide. Uh, and then you have these solid wheels here, which have a humongous contact patch. So I don't think you're gonna have any issues with stability. It starts with one thing. I don't know why. It doesn't even matter how hard you try. Keep that in mind. I'm designed this rhyme to explain in due time. All I know. Time is a valuable thing. Watch it fly by as the pendulum swings. Watch it count down to the end of the day. The clock takes life away. It's so unreal. Didn't look out below. Watch the time go right out the window. Trying to hold on. To didn't even know. I wasted it all just to watch you. Don't know why it doesn't even matter how hard you 
try Keep that in mind I designed this rhyme to remind myself how I tried So hard In spite of the way you were mocking me Acting like I was part of your property Remembering all the times you fought with me I'm surprised it got so Things aren't the way they were before You wouldn't even recognize me anymore Not that you knew me back then But it all comes back to me in the end You kept everything inside And even though I tried It all fell apart be a memory of a time when I, I tried, tried so hard and got so far But in the end, it doesn't even matter I had to fall to lose it all But in the end, it doesn't even matter I put my trust in you Just as far as I can go for all this there's only one thing you should know I've put my trust So I wanted to do something a little bit throwback today. I knew I kind of changed up my um, my set a little bit on my most recent videos, but I wanted to take it back and be a little bit more old school, go back to my roots. But uh, so yeah, so this is the end of my unboxing video for the Lanyards Tugboat for 2022. Uh, I have thoroughly enjoyed this board, you guys. It's been super fun to ride. Uh, now. What I did do though, is I brought out the uh, tugboat from last year. So you guys can kind of see the difference. Last year's is a little bit wider, not by much, just a, about a quarter of an inch, uh, but otherwise they're the same length and the same wheelbase. Now, a couple differences here. So obviously you see that the, the main two differences are aside from the width, the width of the trucks and the wheels. Now, I, uh, I did thoroughly enjoy the, um, the tugboat, my previous version. I really liked the Easy Hogs here, and uh, I really liked the, um, the setup with the trucks. Now, one of the things I liked about these wheels is that they were super easy to slide. I was able to, to push really well, maintain some good speed, and uh, you know, the board still was very carvy and stable. But with this one here, these wheels are have such a nice contact patch. Not only are they very stable, but when I was going over the sidewalk with these, it was so much easier, so much more comfortable because of the width of the wheels. Um, it still maintained that great maneuverability that I think they were going for with the uh, narrower trucks. So I think mission accomplished there. The board did push out really easy. Uh, there was a couple times where it pushed out even more than I was expecting, uh, which is a good thing because you know, that's how I'm gonna practice. Uh, the wheels also had a lot of really good grip. I did have my girlfriend pull me a little bit and, uh, oh, cat hair, cat, excuse me guys. Uh, I did have my girlfriend pull me a little bit and um, and we did get up to about 20, 23, I think 22, 23, not 25, 22, 22 or 23 on this. And uh, even with the the traditional King King Chucks, it was still very stable. Um, I didn't throw out any slides at that speed because I, I wasn't wearing the helmet. She's wearing the helmet that I have right now. So. Um, yeah, I love the board, you guys. I really, really do love this board. Uh, the, if you're worried about it being a little bit narrower, uh, I didn't really notice. I did kind of jump on both boards and I didn't really notice too much. Yeah, so if you want something uh, that you're gonna carry around with you and uh, maybe you have to carry sometimes when you're not riding it, then and weight is a huge concern for you. And you can always go with the previous version, but if, Commuting is your goal and you want a small compact board. I would say this one's probably one of the best. I mean, the simple fact that it's got these really nice wide contact patch, I mean, I really don't think you can go wrong with that. So anyways, I will do a follow-up review down the line, maybe three, four, five months from now, uh, as I like to do. And you guys have seen those. So we'll give it some more time and I'll do a real review. So this is simply an unboxing and first impression video but I, I love the board, you guys. I'm absolutely loving it. So hope you guys enjoy the video. 
Stay safe, stay strong, get out and skate, or do something that makes you happy. Thank you guys.